<sighs> hey, welcome back. Hope you're doing all right. So, last two weeks have been pretty interesting. <laughs> In the tech space anyway, so my tech channel, uh, which I'll link up here, link up here. Uh, on my tech channel, I haven't really talked much about other than just the weekly, weekly updates with uh, tech, but I, I've been working on a number of projects and you know one client in particular we're just smashing all this stuff along it's doing really well mostly on ios and android so i'm really happy with that <clears throat> but i've definitely noticed a slowdown just in terms of like the, the amount of projects people people are going for so it looks like like the in particular the the bubble for crypto is really you know that's popped and, and it's gone it's deflating i mean most of the uh, projects here there and everywhere that have been using crypto that i've known about and i've had friends to work on uh, pretty much just that's it it's gone after ftx everything kind of settled down there was like a there was a peak of bitcoin but uh that went that's kind of like you know stabilized the plateaued really what else most of the other stuff that's going on what else is going on with the with the photography so I don't know what to do. Like I'm doing this photography stuff on my vlog, and really this should just be for just general talk. And uh, I really want to do like not necessarily reviews, but you know, give some content to uh, photography and video that's specific to that channel. So I'm not a professional photographer. Uh, the videography stuff that we're doing uh, is mostly for marketing, for sharing content that's related to the stuff that I build. So the tech channel stuff is really the main kind of bread butter. You know, that's where the interesting stuff is. That's what I'm working on most of the time. Uh, and having, un, you know, picked up how to do DaVinci Resolve and how to film and how to do lighting, it, you know, it's good. I still really want to do a couple of films, documentary film about my dad. And I've got some ideas for just creative stuff. So I think this, that this is like the photography specific vlogs, like taking a photo, stories about photos. Um, well, you know, here's a, here's a funny one, right? So I've got photos that I've taken in the past and they have got personal stories about those photos because something amazing happened with them but I'm not sure whether that would be something that I would go onto this that would go onto the photography channel or go onto the vlog channel right so where, where does it kind of fit maybe kind of like new stuff uh how to but then yeah I don't know it's it's kind of like a it's kind of like too many things right to uh, I thought maybe you do a shot Savara channel with like photography related stuff and then you've got you know, the tech channel stuff is good, like leave all the tech channel stuff there and then and vlog is kind of like more be, maybe just for me just thinking out loud, sharing ideas, like this. It's just me ranting just to myself, really. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'm here, we we're here in Melbourne, uh, you know, taking it easy. We want to travel back to Russia uh, as well. So, you know, there's a few stories about well, why we need to go back to Russia. So, <clears throat> let's... Lots of the stuff that needs to happen. So maybe I should just move to the, the, the future photography stuff, like the actual journey stuff of taking photos. Maybe move that to Shots of Our channel. And then keep this as really just kind of like a reflection and just, you know, me talking to myself, like, and sharing stories and sh about things that aren't related to photography or tech. But then I have the Explore Dr Drugs channel, which is like pharmacology related that I'd really, really want to also dig into. I've got like a, where's my pharmacology book? Here it is. Ring and Dale's Pharmacology. Let me just pull that up. Yeah, so this one here, big one. This is a big pharmacology book. And it, it's just, it's amazing. I love it. I know that I'm into it because I was looking at it and it just fascinates me. It fascinates me how the brain works, how, how all these kind of things fit together. And, you know, there's like, I mean, it would, it would seem that we've kind of got so much information about, you know, how the brain works that we would have figured things out by now. But then the whole imbalance theory of, of depression in particular, like as just an example, isn't even in this. <laughs> There's, there isn't, like, it talks about like certain things that can impact, um, you know, inflammation and, and biological reasons for uh, certain effects, but nothing about really psychiatry. So things like biological things like uh, Parkinson's disease and uh, diabetes, things like that, and you know how to treat those. But when it comes to 
psychiatric diseases. There's nothing really, nothing really there. So it's kind of like really applied stuff. And then we've got artificial chemistry. So kind of like the, this book here, which I've got to get to. Uh, it's like really, really good one. Uh, it's the, it's the kind of middle ground between, uh, let's say, pharmacology and uh, the biological sciences and computer science. Again, like so, it's trying to model things in computers. Really amazing. Uh, stuff that I'd love to get into, but it'll take a lifetime to, to do all this. <laughs> and uh, yeah, simulating, simulating the world with computers. And then there's AI. AI look, my, th my thoughts on AI are just like, it's just a commercial buzzword. And I, I watched a documentary, um, you know, not long ago about the fact that the business of data science has kind of been transformed into the business of AI. Everything was about data science. Didn't make much difference. So now the big hype word to get investors on board is, uh, is AI. Get dives into it, uh, but what kind of real value is it producing? Like, I don't know. Fundamentally, the the values values in life are so far beyond what tech can offer these days that you know, tech is kind of like going off in its own thing. You know, we've got practical the stuff that I'm that I like doing in in tech at the moment is very practical. So I'm building like software that relates directly to things people use in order to repair things, in order to operate machinery, like really physical applied stuff and not so much kind of like the, the consumer end of abstract kind of abstract uh, computer science theory operating systems. AI, AI is like, yeah, look, <laughs> the funny thing is I actually have one client where that we do have an applied yeah, um, set of AI functionalities. No, and But the thing is, I don't like to call it AI because it's not really AI. It's just face recognition. So we're doing face recognition for um, not humans, but for animals. Uh, and it's applied again, but I, there's no AI in it really. It's just here's a trained, here's a model that's been built after feeding it some data. And then we're just checking it against, you know, um, new, new input values for that. So yeah, so much going, it, it's just, there's just so much going on, right? So like this, there's the uh, tech stuff with uh, the, the the production. Oh, my light's gone off. I think that's time to... <laughs> battery ran out of my small rig light there. And um, I want this this light, actually, I'll just tangent again. This light is uh, is good, but the ba I think I've killed the battery. I don't know why. I've kind of left it on charge for too long and it just... The battery doesn't last as long anymore. It's a small rig, Pix M160. So in here, uh, that focus. You see that? I think you need to get the light. The other light. <laughs> so I've actually got a few. Of this yeah, it's not picking up focus. It's picking up my face. There we go. There we go. All right. Lights. Yeah, lots of lights. I actually got a small rig light. Another one, a spotlight. Small, and then I've got another. Small rig 60 watt light there and a 220 watt light there and stuff that I wanted to use for a uh, documentary or just filming which you know The options and the opportunities are endless But the time is finite and the difficulty the most difficult thing is going well What do I want to spend my time on and then and being confident in that decision and comfortable in that decision feeling that you're you know, you're doing the right thing you're on the right path to create a good life or create or be part of something interesting. And one of the things is the, the distraction thing, like being distracted, not just by the stuff that the projects, but even just random stuff, you know, like somebody tells you about some new product, like the rabbit R1 or the, you know, human app, you know, oh, wow, cool, crazy. It's like, a, it felt like a whole distraction. And then, and then the follow on from that was this fact that it's all a scam and that's, you know, full, <laughs> does it matter? Does it impact me? No. Does it matter to me? No. So why do I kind of like, what am I interested in? What was the point of following the exposing of the, the rabbit R1 scan? Maybe because it's drama, you know, we all get caught up in drama and we enjoy being caught up in drama without actually having the eye, eye of Sauron <laughs> on us ourselves and kind of like watching it. Yeah, well, that, that's my thoughts for now. I think, so got to move to the videos the new vi new kind of like a photography centric videos to photography yeah photography centric videos photography and 
guess, video review centric shots of our, the actual films themselves, like little short films and projects and personal stuff I'll leave on this vlog. We've got tech stuff and then we'll see what happens next with the show, with the, uh, the Explore Drugs channel. But I've got all these time lapses, which is good, so I should be able to export those time lapses and put them on Shots of Our channel. So do check it out. Do subscribe if you're one of the 280 or so subscribers on here. Jump on. The Tech Savara stuff, the plan is to really build that, to go and, you know, set up Tech Savara accounts. Uh, we've, I've got like a, a server that I'm setting up for one of the projects I mentioned. Uh, set up Reddit, set up Discord, set up uh, Twitter, set up <clears throat> set up what else uh, Mastodon and uh, you know do the whole thing there and just keep pushing that every week little bit by little bit you know keep growing that so if, I mean the point of the whole tech stuff is just to build the brand you know build and continue doing the whole explore videos to build my own personal knowledge in, in different fields and yeah so let's just keep going I mean yeah it's almost a half a year half a year mark I'm gonna do a few more videos before that before we do like a end of end, end of financial year. it's winter here so it's almost like it's really kind of when Christmas should be in south in south uh, southern hemisphere okay guys <laughs> this is me for a ramble just a bit of a ramble today just a few ideas the main thing is just moving the photography stuff to shots of our Anyway, I'll see you next time. Thanks for tuning in. I'll speak to you soon. Bye.